So today I'm using one of my best friends, Mahal, to show off this look from the Revealed One palette from Coastal Scents. It's supposed to be the perfect dupes for Urban Decay's Naked 1 and 2 palettes, and it's very darn affordable, I tell you that. I'm starting out with an eyeshadow primer. This will help keep it all in place, and to me, primers help the eyeshadow appear the best that it can on the eyelid. Now if you don't have one, that is perfectly okay. Concealer works just fine. Now I'm not quite sure the name of this color right here, so I'm just going to go with a mauve brown, if that makes any sense. It's very, very buildable, I would say, and I'm actually not going to go too hard on the color on her eyes because I am trying to, still trying to go for that natural kind of look. I want the glam part to this look to be more from the eyeliner and mascara. But it is a very natural color, and I'd say it goes really well with Mahal's beautiful bright blue eyes. I'm starting to go in now with this dark brown right there. I'm going to put it in Mahal's crease of her eyelid and also the outer corners. As you can see, I'm making this V shape and I'm using an angle brush to do that. It just works best for me. I don't quite have the talent to do that with a straight edge brush, but it makes it easier for you as well. And with this color that I'm using, it actually got on the brush very well. You don't have to press very hard or anything. So just Keep, a, keep that in mind um, so you don't get too much product on the brush, but if you do and get these harsh edges, that's okay because we are now about to dot, 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 blend, 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 blend it out, get those edges and smooth it into the other color that's already on the eyelid there. And look at that, it's already looking better and there's Mahal, she even agrees, you see that little smile? <laughs> and just keep doing that until you reach to a look that you feel comfortable with. Now I'm going to use this color right here that is the perfect dupe of Suspect from the Naked 2 palette. And I'm just patting it in the center of Mahal's eyelid. This will create a really nice highlight and the way that the light hits her eyelids will pick that up very nicely. It's a very buildable color. So I'm just going to put a little bit more on than usual just so I could get a little bit more of a shimmery look. Now just like before, we're going to take our blending eye brush and blend that color out into the other darker brown that we already have there. Now the last color we're using is this pretty nice pale color that we have there and I'm just using that to highlight the brows, show off them brows that that girl got. <laughs> and this is a very buildable color as well but actually to my surprise a lot of product came on as you can see right there look at that oh my goodness a lot of product came onto the brush so you don't have to worry about patting down too hard, I'd say, but to mix it all together like we have been before, we're going to surprise blend, but I'm sure you already knew that. <laughs> Now this part is completely optional. I'm taking that angled eye brush that we used on Mahal's crease and outer corner and that dark brown as well and I'm just lining the lower lash line to create a little dimension into this eye look. You can use eyeliner, you don't have to do this at all, whatever you feel comfortable with. This is completely up to you but I wanted to keep a little bit of a natural look here. And there you have it. All you need is a little bit of eyeliner and mascara, and you're good to go.